Sports brings us to North Carolina and Bank of America Stadium here in Charlotte. The kickoff team on the field now as they will send this one away. And we'll see a return here from the end zone. And a nice return sets him up pretty good here right at the 30-yard line. So first and 10 now from the 30. Right to the air is Mahomes. He'll buy some time right. He'll get this complete to Kadarius Tony. And he'll be taken down, but not before they work it across midfield. Good work after the catch. Going to net him 23 and a first. Second and eight coming up. He was brought down at the 45 yard line. Again, and two brings up seven. Again, it's Pacheco. Now, third down is looming. A pickup of two on first down and just one yard there. Now, Mahomes going to shift him around. On third down, he'll drop to throw. Work in the middle of the field, and he's got a man complete. And he gets it all the way down inside the 10 and mark him at the 5. They'll run here with Pacheco. And he is met in his tracks behind the line of scrimmage. Second and goal from the 6 this time. Now they'll audible to something else. Mahomes to throw on second down. Sliding out of the pocket. And fights through one. And he will take it on in for a Chiefs touchdown. Patrick Mahomes, a six-yard touchdown run. And the Chiefs put the Knights' first points on the board as they take the early lead. Andy Reid never one to shy away from taking chances. He'll go for two. Rolling to his right. This is caught. Was he in? Yes, I kick. Harrison Butler had a kick off for Kansas City. And it looks like the Panthers' hands team does its job. So an onside kick fail in the first quarter. Not sure I completely see the logic there. It's not apparent, is it? You almost have to gain an advantage, and they tried. They just didn't get it done. That throw by Young incomplete. Complete pass on first down. That leads to a second and ten. A quick throw complete to Chark. Five yards. Now it's third and five. That's probably as simple of a throw as he'll have all game. And good for everyone. Good for his completion percentage. Good for the receptions for the receivers. But you know how they work on that. They have footballs with no laces. So as soon as you get the snap, you're just throwing the football, all right? You're not trying to find the laces and grip it a certain way. That takes time. Just get the ball and throw it. So that's how they practice it all the time now, too. And he's going to be out of bounds down around the 35-yard line. Maybe not exactly what they had in mind, but that scramble good for six and a first down. Now Young for Marshall. That's complete. And he'll lose yardage on the play back at the 37-yard line. A loss of two brings up second and 12. Second down, Young. And that falls to the ground incomplete. A nice job of bodying him up defensively. And now it brings up third down. We'll see what they have drawn up here. A little bit behind the line. 12 yards needed to gain a first down. Young on third down. And he's going to be sacked. They sack him back right at the midfield stripe. And how about this? Fourth and long, and they're going to go for it.
From the midfield stripe, they'll look to throw. Eluding the pressure right. And it's incomplete. They cannot convert, and they turn it over. A surprising move to go for it predictably, at least somewhat predictably. It doesn't pay off, and this defense will take over right at midfield. On first and ten, here's Pacheco. And nothing but green grass here, middle of the field. And he takes it down deep into enemy territory. Well, that didn't take long. One play, and we're already looking at a first and goal situation. And now we get a timeout called on the defensive side of the ball by the Panthers. They'll have two remaining as we step aside here in this first quarter. Pacheco is into the end zone. Touchdown, Kansas City. Now Mahomes to the line as the Chiefs are going to go for the two-point try. Mahomes will throw for it. And the conversion good. He's got it. Go onside kick. And it looks like the Panthers' hands team does its job. Yeah, we saw that one up here, CD. Offensive team, they touched that before. Here we go. They'll run, it's Sanders. And he'll get it inside the 35. 16-0, that's the score after one on EA Sports. Second quarter now from Charlotte, and it's the Panthers with the football. They'll go again with Sanders. And he'll take this close to a first down at the Chiefs 29. A gain of three last play. This time they double it and pick up six. I really like the offense. They'll come to the line needing only two yards to gain the first here. On third down, they'll run it with Sanders. And that one going nowhere from the start as he's met in the backfield and goes backwards. It's a 47-yard field goal try from here, but instead they're going to opt to go for it on fourth down. And he's able to pick up the first down here before he goes down at the 26. Just a gain of three, but they'll certainly take it as they convert on fourth down. The fourth down run successful. Now they look to pay it off on first down. They'll try to throw now. Young. That is taken in by Hurst. Touchdown. Hayden Hurst. 26 yards. Oh, they flip it to the kicker. He looks like he's going to throw it. It's caught inside the five. And he's across of the gate. We're going to get a delay. That flag accepted, and it backs the offense up a little bit. Yellow. Now they need 15 yards on this series after the delay of game. First and 15. Pacheco gets it up the gut. And the hole closes quickly there. He gets maybe a couple up to the 38. Well, obviously, they would have at least liked to have gotten back to the original line of scrimmage. Instead, now, they're dealing with second and long. I thought they would have passed it after the penalty. Probably wish they would have now. Pacheco gets it again on second down. A short gain of just over two yards as the first half clock dips inside of three minutes. Tough spot here, third down and 11. Looking to throw is Mahomes. Oh, he tries to force it in, and it's intercepted. Jeremy Chin picks it off, and he'll take it across midfield and down to the 48-yard line. A little jet sweep to start the drive. 
And just no chance of turning the corner. He can only get back to the line of scrimmage. Second and ten coming up. Two-minute mark in this first half of action. Now a second and ten. Young. The Sanders has got it complete. And he's corralled, but not before getting it inside the 35. First down now, but that can't Young to throw it. Looking underneath and finding Hubbard. And they'll get him down after a pickup of eight, second and two. Just about every quarterback is trained to really look downfield first before you come back and make a nice, safe throw. And in this case, that's exactly what he did. Found his running back, let him create some space, and it turned out to be a nice play for the offense. And yeah, they'll bring him down at the 18-yard line. Seven yards there and a first down. The Panthers going to use the second of their timeouts as a stop it with a tick under a minute to go before half. So from inside the 20, here's first and 10 at the 18. Throwing Young. He's got it for a Panther touchdown. Jonathan Mingo, an 18-yard touchdown grab. And the Panthers get a late score here in the final minute of the first half. There was a lot of zip on that pass, and baseball might have called that a frozen rope. I like it when you bring the diamond into the game. I'm going back to the gridiron. Had some heat on that pass. They're going to stay out there and go for two. They'll turn to Sanders, and he'll get into the end zone, and those two points bring it out of the end zone. Not a good one. The KC offense out of the huddle, ready for their next drive. And they've got just over 50 seconds to go till halftime, so they can try to put something together if they want. Here's Edwards and Lair as they will start on the ground. Five yards is the tally on first down. That brings up second and five. Now the Panthers going to six, seven seconds to go in half number one. Run by Pacheco on second down. And he'll be brought down right at the 30 here. 63 yards for him on the ground so far tonight as he has been terrific in this first half. That's a good, nice... Mahomes on the give to Edwards Alaire. And defensively, they're just looking to keep him contained as they're able to get him down. Time for a break. We've hit halftime. Two quarters down, two still remain. We step us in. Ready to get the party started for the second half. It was an even first half, all tied on the scoreboard. A tie game. I don't think anybody in this building, including you or I, was expecting that. <laughs> no, I would agree with that totally. I didn't expect to see it at all, but I kind of like where they were going with this. You know, as you said, tie game, trying to steal a possession, steal an advantage, and you told your defense at the half you were going to do it, which also told them that you had confidence in them in case it failed, as that one just did. And now you've given good field position here to start the third quarter. And he'll maneuver his way forward for about four, second and six. Well, we all know the guy carrying the ball is going to get the credit, both in the stat line and probably the receivers are involved. They're moving the ball well. Second down, another chance for Hubbard. They're able to push forward for about four down to the 37. Back to back four yard runs. Now, look, hey, if they just do that all the way downfield, ball ends up in the end zone, but that's a little difficult to do. Yeah, I think now third and two, that defense ready to stiffen up and stop that run. And he'll lose yardage. 
yardage here, back at the 41. The offense going to stay out there. They've converted once, failed once. What can they do here on fourth down? Now here's Young. He's got his running back out of the backfield. And he gets it inside the 35 and just shy of the 30. That's a fourth down pickup of 10 yards. And it up the middle they go with Sanders. He'll be dropped at the 25 after a gain of six. And now they're in the hurry up. Second down, back to Sanders. And he'll be brought down inside the 20 at the 19. So here's a first and 10 now, down inside the 20. They go play action. Young, they'll roll him out right. And he is out of bounds, looks like right at the 15. He'll wind up getting right about four there on the scramble, and it's second down. I think the defense surprised him there with that blitz on first down, but give him credit. Stayed cool under pressure and still found a way through the extra rushers for positive yardage. Well done. To throw on second down is Young. And he will find his man on the outside. And the Panthers are going to have a first and goal as he'll be taken down at the seven-yard line. That was a round run, not just with dexterity, but with intelligence. Found the hole in the zone, made sure the quarterback saw him, and was able to make the sure catch and flip the down marker back to one. They'll run with Sanders. And he gets halfway there from the six to the three on a gain of three. That's good power football on first and goal. A lot of teams will throw from there. But that's what... So far, they've come up empty on. They'll look to reverse that trend on second and goal. And he is going to lose yardage here. So a little extra time to ponder this third and goal as we play three quarters. We'll return with more after this break. You're watching the NFL on EA Sports. A lot of tired bodies on that field, but this is a big play, third and goal. And he will take it across for Hendricks' touchdown. Bryce Young, a four-yard touchdown scamper. And the Panthers have broken our tie and have taken a fourth-quarter lead. So what a comeback here. They look like they might be down and out not too long ago, but they have rallied back to take a fourth quarter lead. And I think we've got to give them nothing but credit for figuring things out on the fly because... Oh, they flip it to the kicker. He looks like he's going to throw it. And it's intercepted at the goal line. And the Chiefs are right back in this football game. And boy, figure this one out. Leading here in the fourth. And now they're going to try an onside kick. The Chiefs now are going to use the first of their timeouts. That'll leave them with two remaining. We'll be back after this. The Carolina kick team is out there ready to go. And they kick this one away. Starting field position here as that's taken up close to the 40. The Chiefs offense about set to begin this drive. And now they'll look to answer working from behind. And remember, this offense has sputtered yet to score here in the second half. They'll need to change that here. And able to get this one all the way up to about the 46-yard line. 70 yards rushing feet. Here's Pacheco once again. And he'll get it down to the 47 here. Seven yards there and a first down. Oh, that's 
That's one to warm the hearts of all those old school football players, isn't it? Tough, hard, gritty run, got behind his pads, bowled over a few people. Look at that one, right up the gut. So up through three quarters, no reason to lighten up now. And it's straight, it's Pacheco. And it worked down inside the 45. Give credit to the defense for stringing that play out. And they gave up no cutback angle. You know he was trying to dart through. No place for him to go. A nice job there, only giving up a three-yard gain. Accept the penalty, of course, and push the offense backwards a bit. Now Mahomes throwing on second down. Pitch and catch here to Travis Kelsey. And he's got this down a yard or two shy of the 40 before he's out of bounds. So the completion good for seven there. And it brings up third and second catch. Yeah, and people have to come up with schemes to limit him. And, and what a lot of teams do, the double him. You know, use a linebacker underneath, a safety over the top. Sometimes they'll just take a corner, maybe their third corner if he's a bigger guy, and put him on a man-to-man -to, -man to try and limit his touches. Just keep mixing it up, giving different angles, different looks, like a good boxer does. Well, I think we were both wondering if we were going to see them try and push it deep downfield facing a one-possession deficit late, and they certainly didn't disappoint. They gave it an effort. Got a man, it's caught inside the 10. And in for the Chiefs. And it looks like the Panthers' hands team does its job. The risk-reward of the onside kick. When you don't get it, the risk comes out to play, and here they gave it. Advantages when you have them. And field position leads you to that type of play calling. And whether you want to blitz or whether you want to throw the ball deep, those types of things, now they've given up that type of field position, the advantage has switched to their opponent. And as a defensive end, getting off the ball quickly, swarming to the football, making a tackle, that's what we saw right there. Yeah, and that's what their job is. And really, a lot of the time, they have to throttle back a little bit in the run game because you know those defensive ends, they're like in a sprinter stance. They're just headed straight for the quarterback. That was good recognition on that play to hold them to no gain. Second down, back to Sanders. They know that old expression, it's not my night. It hasn't been his so far. I don't know if the legs are a little bit heavy. Sometimes having to hang out all day and play doesn't exactly play to your advantage, but it's been a tough go for him. And every time he looks up, somebody's there defensively. That was the same case on that play. Now Young. It's caught by Sanders. And he'll lose yardage here back at the 47. Partner, you've got about 20 coaches on your payroll, but there's 60,000 of them in the stands. I don't think any of them like that play. And the later we go, it's starting to sound like 100,000 in here. Ready. Too far for a field goal. They've got to go. It's fourth down. Here's Young. Such little time remaining, and the Chiefs are likely going to win the football game. The KC offense out of the huddle, ready for their next drive. And three timeouts remaining here defensively, but really not much reason to use them at this point as this one is all but over. If they use the timeouts here, it's strictly for show. We got a plane to catch. We have to imagine this will be on the ground as well as they come up second and seven. He's going to get it again. Just looking to get forward and protect the ball. The Panthers going to use the second of their timeouts as they get it right at the 32nd mark of this fourth quarter. They'll come up now third and three. Mahomes to throw. Escaping the pressure right. 
That is intercepted. Picked off by Von Bell. Now he's loose down the left sideline. And he will bring this one back. It's a pick six for a Panther touchdown. Charles, I'm looking at you, and understandably, your mouth is wide open in disbelief. What were they thinking? That's going to be one of the great mysteries, but I do know this. When they went out on offense, I will guarantee they told them, don't just make anticipatory throws. Make sure you see it before you throw it. Didn't happen here. Trying to protect that lead, and now they gave it up. Hammering for the goal line. He loses the football. And it's picked up by the Chiefs. They're going to make it to the 13-yard line and no further. Here's first down. Mahomes. He'll buy some time right. And that's going to be too high. Out of bounds and incomplete. And now time is a giant issue. That would have been important to maybe get you into Hail Mary range. But this defense is certainly going to make it tough. And that's going to fall incomplete. Another try, second and ten now. Here's Mahomes. Looking for Gray, and he's got him. And they nearly get this all the way to midfield. Mark him down at the 49. Now they do indeed get the timeout. So on is not lost. They'll have a chance for one final heave to the end zone. One final try for Mahomes. He's going to let it fly. This ball intercepted. Dante Jackson picks it. So they'll accept that penalty, and that'll, of course, move the football up the field. One final shot. They'll look to throw. He lets this one fly toward the back of the end zone. And this is incomplete. So no miracles here on the final play. And this ball game is over. So this one is over. A victory for Carolina. And we talked so much about the turnover battle, determining who wins, who loses. This game, no exception. Air-free football, no turnovers at all, and they win it. So this is one you don't have to convince your team that what you're saying is accurate. And you know.